we went out yesterday and got um, a bunch of chanterelles in the rain. We had a mushroom omelet mm -hmm. and you made a Hungarian, Hungarian mushroom, mushroom soup. soup. Oh my God, it was so good. But we have so many mushrooms that we have too many that we can eat right now. So then what we do is we process them uh, so that we can freeze them and enjoy them for the rest of the year until next year's chanterelle season. Mm -hmm. So Silk has been using uh, flannel. basically a yeah, flannel rag. To... But you can also use a paintbrush, a clean paintbrush. Works also really well. And then there's a little dirt right here. I cut that off. Use a pine needle. But you know, a little dirt is good from the forest because it's good for, it's probiotic. And this is what you're gonna fry, right? Yeah. Yeah. spot I don't think so this is going in the compost yeah all right what did you put the pan on hi hi and there's no nothing just mushrooms, just mushrooms. no oil no right. spices no water and she's got a bowl here ready to save the, the water that comes out of them. For soup. For soup, yes. And then I need to get in. How do you tell when they're done? When the pan doesn't, if the mushrooms don't lose water anymore. Okay. So you just stick them in the freezer, uncovered and everything. Yeah. Until they freeze, right? Yes. And, and then, then you pop them out of that pan and put them in a plastic bag. Yeah.